Hey, this is Dr. B with Barada Holistic Center here in Carmichael, California. And uh, today we're talking about uh, the benefits, the many benefits of bone broth. If you've never heard of bone broth, uh, it actually may sound kind of gross, but it's really not. It's actually really good. Let's face it, in our regular diet, it's hard to get the essential nutrients that our body requires. So what do we do? We go to the store, we spend lots and lots of money on supplements. Um, and we try to um, make up for um, you know our our diets lacking in these in these nutrients. So um, instead, um, bone broth uh, provides the absolute uh, essential nutrients that our body needs. The key nutrients such as calcium, magnesium, phosphorus, zinc, all really really good for uh, bone and joint health. Obviously, in our office, we see a lot of patients with. Uh, bone and joint problems, osteoporosis, osteoarthritis, any type of degenerative condition. Um, so bone broth can really help because it has high amounts of glucosamine and chondroitin. Um, you've probably heard of that before. Um, those are key supplements that a lot of arthritic patients take. Uh, so bone broth has a high abundance of, of, those, two, uh, of those two vitamins and minerals. So um, also great for um, gut health for int if you have any digestive issues um, if you're having immunity problems um, if you're fighting off something um, and also for dental for gum health really really good stuff so how do you take bone broth well one of two ways you first you can go to the store you can buy it I would recommend uh, something organic the second way better yet is to make it yourself real simple um, it takes a little time, but here it is. Basically, you're going to get a big pot. You're going to fill it up with water, maybe three quarters of the way, and you're going to get the bones, two or three bones, of, of an organically raised animal. So if you're a vegetarian, you might want to turn it off right here. Um, then you're going to add uh, some roughly chopped carrots, celery, maybe two or three, of each then you're gonna get uh, a couple of onions you're gonna have them you're gonna put those in there as well those are white onions by the way then you're gonna get one bunch of parsley one bunch of cilantro you're gonna add that you're gonna bring it to a boil and then you're gonna let it simmer for anywhere from three to six hours you'll see some stuff rising up to the top you can scoop that out but uh, and then you can add a little salt and pepper just to taste and that's that's pretty much you got your bone broth and then also I'm sorry one thing I forgot is adding apple cider vinegar um, to that okay which also provides a lot of key nutrients after that you take it off you let it sit for about an hour and then after an hour or so you can um, you can put it into containers preferably glass containers um, I'd, I'd avoid anything plastic so there's your health tip for today. Thank you for listening. If you have any questions, call the number 916-979-0716. Thanks for listening.